Houston area lawmakers say having chaplains in schools could help fill guidance counselor vacancies. That's the idea behind Senate Bill 763. If passed and signed into law, it could take effect in the upcoming school year. KPRC 2's Rowan Belogan joining us live to explain why a chaplain says their services would help. Rowan? Lisa, the, a member of the International Fellowship of Chaplains says that chaplains are trained in crisis intervention, meaning their services could be beneficial inside schools. But a union president says guidance counselors, counselors also have that same training and they're state certified. Chaplains are trained to deal with grief and loss, recognize students that are traumatized, help those that are depressed, and also recognize addictions. Kathy Birding is with the International Fellowship of Chaplains. She spoke in front of lawmakers supporting Senate Bill 763, which if passed would allow chaplains in schools working with school counselors. Having school chaplains can provide a way for students to make better life choices, avoid unhealthy lifestyles. Jackie Anderson, the president of the Houston Federation of Teachers, which includes guidance counselors, doesn't have an issue with chaplains. She just doesn't think they have a role in schools. That's the job of the counselor, fund the schools and pay for counselors. They are trained to work with students. Chaplains are not. They're not trained to work with students. Under the bill, chaplains aren't required to be certified by the State Board of Educator Certification. State Senator Mays Middleton is the author. Schools don't have to hire chaplains under this bill. However, for the same reasons chaplains work so well and do so much for our public safety and those in our first those first responders that we rely on. Now, under the bill, chaplains will be required to be certified or rather be endorsed by a religious organization and pass a background check. Reporting live, Roman Belogan, KPRC 2 News.